Welcome back to part two of Layers of Fear, the full game. My name is Zinthus. It's weird, I know. My real name is Nathan. It rings a bell. Why why do you say that? Why am I getting all these chi Never mind. You've been snooping around my workshop again. For the last time, you were not allowed in that room, even if the door happens to be open. I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. Our guy, our painter here, he's, he's starting to lose the plot. He's a few cans short of a six-pack. He's a few sandwiches short of a picnic. He's, um... Few dimes short of a shilling. Whatever. Get the idea. Baby, come back. Right. Aha. Anything in here? Aha. Anything in here? No. Anything, anything in here? No. Is there a bottom drawer? No, I can't see a thing. Might be a bit lighter for you because I've brightened it up. So. Yeah, I was expecting that. Why would you leave a trap door there, though, in a house? It doesn't make sense. My love. Oh, this is small writing. Okay, alright, that's even better. Okay, my love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago. All I had was talent and ambition. Now against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband and you. I have never been a deeply religious person, I guess. What other people look for in a sermon, I found in perfecting my art. But now I can't help but feel there's a higher power watching over me. They once told me that I should never succeed as a mu musician. Now I'm playing sold out concert concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character. What's that mean? And that I should and that I would never find a soulmate. Guess again. Finally a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own, and yet here you are within me. I am quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. I didn't see that note before. <laughs> <laughs> that was thick, that jump scare. That noise really gets to me though. Rat. There's a lot of things in this game that I, uh, I've missed out. What are you doing there now? Where's the bit? He's slightly higher up or something. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> you damn right. Shake that ass for me. Shake that ass for me. I've got to be honest though, how good looking is this game? If you know somebody that might want to play this, by the way. I don't know. Find a good episode. 
an eventful one, should I say, of, of my Let's Plays and show it to them because this game is wonderful. It is wonderful. It's so good. Why are the rats doing it? I don't know. Dead rats. Yeah, I remember that as well. Okay. Yeah, let's get out of here. I'm really excited. I'm really excited to see what new things are here in, the, in this game, in this full version of the game. Okay, right, close, bitch. Close. Just, just close. Let's get some shoes. Okay, right. Um, okay. Oh, note, okay. Hey, in regards to your previous letter, I'm sure it's nothing to be too concerned by. Women tend to get weird after having a baby, hormone imbalances and, and the like. When we ha had our first, I remember Valerie got the blues real bad. I would ask her what she wanted for lunch and she just burst into tears. Just be there for her and I'm sure it's going to be fine. Now, I know I promise not to rush you by all means, enjoy your well-deserved time off. But just to let you know, I'm getting phone calls. I'm getting phone calls up the yin yang, commission left and right. You're a hot ticket, my friend. Maybe we should strike the iron while it's hot. But of course, the family comes first. Your friend and agent, Thomas Caldwell. All right then. So our wife, she was a bit of a celebrant. In a good way, she was really successful, a musician. Could this have made us, the artist, jealous? And now that he's become successful, he's neglecting his family? She's not nice at all. Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? Oh my god, she's got a voice. I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Sorry, baby. Um, yeah. Baby blues, I guess. Oh, she's not nice to look at. She's not nice to look at. At all. Paprika. Paprika. More paprika. Spicy. Oh shit, where am I going? Alright, okay. As you can tell, I'm being quite confident moving around mostly anyway. Um. That's because I'm familiar with this much of the game. But there does some, seem to be some new additions. I love it. I love it. I was so excited the last time I played this. What? Anything? Anything to pick up? Guess not. Oh! Oh shit, there wasn't blood on that before. Oh! Canvas. Oh, blood's on it Not now. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. You heard the guy. He's making art with tissue. Oh wow, this is so cool. 
Right, that wasn't there before. Nice. Hit. Even now. Alright. Okay, wow, the letter's slowly being built as well. Nice, it's opened. I always thought they looked like a pair of flamingos. And of course there's the quote from the guy. There's another note. Deep breaths, remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes, then you're over the hump. What's so hard about that? A good question. Right. Yep. Dickens, what the Dickens? Yep. <laughs> oh god, this is the full game. Yeah. Can you jump? Can you jump? No, you can't. I would be jumping for joy right now. Oh wow, that was new! What was that? What, what did that say? would be. God. <laughs> oh yeah, the key. Oh, I know it as well. Dear sir. No. Dear sir. Well, I can certainly understand that you are upset and I have nothing but sympathy for your wife and yourself. I must categorically state that I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you in this matter. Any skin graft procedure is extremely complicated and inherently associated with the risk of failure. Having stated that, I assure you that me and my colleagues at St. Anne have made every effort to ensure a pro a positive outcome for your wife. Personally speaking, I believe we have done the best job possible considering the extent of the tissue damage. You are, of course, entitled to your opinion and I can certainly understand your disappointment. What I do not understand is how you seem to th think writing hateful letters to me or my fellow doctors will ameliorate your, the situation. As I've already stated, I can certainly understand you've become under a lot of stress of late, and thus I will not press charges if you refrain from any further correspondence. Let me make it absolutely clear that I will not tolerate any further threats aimed at my, at my staff, my family, or myself. If you wish to seek psychological help, I can have my assistant provide contact information for several, several specialists who could be more than competent to help you get through these hard times. With regards and best wishes for you and your wife, William H. Green, medical doctor. I've got the key. I've got the secret. Why did you stop? That tune was perfect. Honey, please, just a little longer. At least until I finish painting this one part. Don't make me beg. Right. So it's the wife that's... It, was it the wife who lost the leg? Oh. Ah. I'm really tempted to go down that ele elevator now. Oh. Oh shit. Did I go down the elevator in the last in my last playthrough? I don't know. Oh, this is new. Oh, this is so new. Oh shit. 
Oh. Ah. Wow. Oh my god. It's new content this early in. I was getting nervous opening a door. What? <laughs> I was expecting that as well. God. Right, right. Yes. Okay. So, that is it for part two of Layers of Fear, the full game. Join me for part three. Let me know what you think of this episode and if you think I've missed anything out. Please, let me know because I, I can't catch anything, everything, can I? Anyways, thank you very much for watching. Join me on the next, next episode. You've been watching Synthus. Bye. So let's continue with this uh, enthralling game.